Hey guys, this is Sparky129 here, and welcome back to another Train Simulator race. This episode, it's going to be very short if I did only one race this time, so we're going to do two. The first race will be very easy to tell who's going to win, but we're going to try it anyway. The standard Twift Dog Tank, as opposed to the advanced one from way back, against the modified Hall class, which did win against the... Uh, one of the Panya Tank versions in the last round. Now, the other race we're going to do today, which might be a slightly more interesting, barely, is the 8750, which won, which was doing the same speed as the 5700, but still won, against the ever famous and popular Mallard. So, let's go to those first. This one first, and then we'll see Mallard in action. See you soon. I feel like this one was the one I'm meant to be using with it. Hopefully you guys will tell me, but apparently the previous one was not the right one, so maybe this is. And this one's going to be very easy to see who's going to win. I might as well try it. I guess. Let's program them. Yes, service 1 will be going to platform 12. T touch it right, click on it right, uh, 175%, and then service 2, close to platform 14, 175%. I'm kind of hoping that the, um, the dock tank will at least start off quicker, but it's a dock tank, so who knows? I doubt it. So, let's just click play, let's just see how this race goes. As always, I'll be driving the Super Class 47. And we'll see who wins. Oh, here they are. Yes, it does start quicker. And at least with this one, you can see the wheels move. Hmm, wonder how long until the whole class catches up. Let's find out then, shall we? Here it is. I can hear it's gaining its speed. Let's at least catch up to the dock tank. It's going fast for a dock tank. The advanced one wasn't going this fast. At all. That's amazing. And it's still speeding up. What is with the standard dock tank, not the advanced one? Oh my god, it's still speeding up! Alright, that's too fast. Whoops. Aye, aye, aye. Oh my god! A tank engine going over 120 miles an hour. The whole class is left behind in the dust. This is harder than I thought it would be. So anyway, I'll keep it the dock tank for now, and at the straight, I will see how fast it's going. Unless the whole class catches up. We'll see. Let's double check. Wow. Wow! It's probably in the corner now. Oh, wow. Alrighty, are we on the straight yet? We are now, so let's speed match. Let's see how fast it's going. 100 and... About 122. Yeah, 122, wow. Yeah, it's... What are we about to say? Wow, 122 miles an hour. I'm curious how fast the, uh, the, uh, the, 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 the whole class is going, so I'm going to stop here. I'm going to go back to the beginning of that, this straight, and I want to check how fast the whole class is going. Well, there it is, alright. Let me just get to the corner. And then I can... Right, slow down now. Alrighty. Here it is, it's coming. Here it is. Alright, I'm ready to speed up now. And... Doesn't... Well, it sounds like it's going pretty fast. Let's go! Really? Really? Almost 70 miles an hour. It's not catching up anytime soon. Are you serious? What was the last race this participated in? 
because that is not fast. 70 miles, 72 miles an hour. No way. It's not catching up to 122 mile per hour tank engine. Oh my god. Well, this is completely different to how I thought it would be. I'm gonna give my thoughts about this right now, because I thought that this engine, this modified hull class, would be absolutely going fast. And by the way, as you might have seen earlier, this is 175%. This is a joke. But at the same time, <laughs> the tank engine is also a joke. That's going ridiculously fast. I want to go catch up to that, I want to see how it's going. I can't even see it, that's how far ahead it's gone. That's amazing. A tank engine going 122 miles per hour. And a Tendra engine not going 100 miles per hour at all. Incredible. Where is it? Oh my god, there it is. Oh wow. I have a lot of catching up to do. I honestly did not think the dock tank would go this fast. I didn't think the whole class would go that slow either, but here we are. This is amazing. I love this. I don't know about you, but I find it's absolutely hilarious that a tank engine is this far ahead of a tender engine. This is what I have these races for. To see stuff like this. Obviously tender engines are usually faster than tank engines. This is not like that at all. This is a super tank engine. And that I find hilarious. The advanced dock tank was somehow going extremely slow. Stupidly slow sometimes. This, the not advanced one, the regular one, this one is better in every way. Ah, oh, you love to see it, don't you? Just watching it in action, basically. Oh, wait, we're on the final corner. Didn't know that. Alrighty, well, I'm gonna go, since we're on the final corner, I'm gonna go wait at the end for this tank engine because we know it's going to win at this point so see you soon buddy there's the dock tank at near the end of the um straight we just came out of the corner before let's wait for it to come down here shall we here's the dock tank near the end of the line it is coming in for sure oh definitely Here it is, slowly getting to the end. It's definitely slowed down a lot now, but I can't say the same for the whole class, I can't even see it. And... This tank engine, this dock tank, is the winner of today's race. Oh, you love to see it. Incredible. Now, while we're here, let's see, officially, where that pool class is. Map. Aha, it's on the straight. <laughs> it's on the second last straight, before the final corner. How sad. 72 miles per hour, versus 122 miles per hour, and that is a tender engine that's losing. That has lost. Oh my god. Well, I'm not even going to wait here for the whole class. I have another race to get to, so I'll see you then. Here they are. Oh, the penny tank's got a fast start. Very fast. Compared to Mallard, at least. Wow, you started a bit slow today, Mallard, don't you? Interesting. So let's try and keep up with them straight away. Alrighty. Here's Mallard, he's clearly speeding up. It sounds like it. Let's go see how fast the uh, panty tank is doing, shall we? Alright, it's doing 75, approximately 75 miles an hour. 75 and a half. So if we stay here, then I'm sure Mallard will catch up to us any point soon. I wonder if it is already. Hard to tell right now, but we'll see. Well, at least the Penny Tank had a good start, but we'll see how it goes. We're 
almost to the first corner. I actually got to the speed match with the Pannier tank. Let's just wait for Mallard to catch up, because I know it's going to at some point. I think it is catching up already. Alright. Uh, let me get in front of the Pannier tank, naturally. And we'll wait for that to happen, because I can see it getting closer. Ooh, it's getting closer. Here's the Pannier tank. Still with us. Here's Mallard! There it is! Like the speed demon it is. I'm gonna catch up to Mallard. I'm gonna see how fast that one's doing. Oops, sorry. Hi, Mallard! Jeez, you're going fast. Uh, yeah! Alright, I can hear it. There it is. It's going super fast for a steam engine. Wow, it's going over 166. Uh, let's see. Alright, still catching up a little bit. 168 approximate. Oh, damn it, I'm in the next corner. Wow, it's super fast. Wow, that is amazing! It's so fast! Alright, let me try and actually speed match now. There we are, I think I am now. Doing 100, 167 miles per hour. Now this is cool. This is an awesome race. It's still slightly speeding up, so let me try and match it again. And it's slowing down. Alright, well, I am going to do some drive-bys or standstill buys with this thing. So I'm going to find some good spots for it. Let's go! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god! You can see how fast it is right now! Here it is, getting close to the corner. The final quarter of the race. Woo! Oh, Mallard's already on the straight. Wow, that's fast. And here is Mallard on the final straight of the race. It's done it, it's proved its worth. I can tell this is definitely going to go straight to the finals. This is the fastest engine I have ever had in this race so far, in these races. And the dock tank surprised me as well, but this one, Mallard, even though I know it's really fast, it beat its speed record already. It doesn't need to, but it did. 128 miles per hour, it could easily go over that. Like a lot. Wow, that is awesome. So, Mallard has won this race, and where on the map is the A750? Let's check. Oh no, it's on the... one of the short straights. It's doing good, it did start well, but Mallard has really beaten it. And this is probably the most decent race where the loser is as far back as this. Goes to show how fast Mallard can be. That is incredible. So I'm going to stop this race here. Or sorry, leave the race here because it's finished now. Because Mallard has now won along with the dock tank from the previous race. Let's go back to the tournament, shall we? Wow, both of those races were incredible. For this first one, I honestly thought the whole class would do better than it did. I thought the stock tank would do worse than it did, it's about the same as the advanced version, which didn't even have moving wheels. But no, the dock tank won that race. I bet for certain that it doesn't hold a candle to Mallard though, because wow that speed, that was incredible. I'm sure it'll have some great distance at first, but not for long. <laughs> Alright, next race will be the Grange class versus the 4F. I'm going to make a bet and say that the Grange class will win, 
but the 4F will have a good start. For the next race, after that, for this round, will be the castle class versus a one specific castle, Nunny Castle, who didn't race the last time. Same with the 4F, honestly, but, and same with Mallard. And same with the standard dog tank. Anyway, getting off track. Uh, I'm going to take a prediction, a bet, or predictions are what I'm looking for, never mind, that the castle class, not the specific named one, will win. Because that does really well, normally. Whereas that, not so much. But, that is it for this race, these two races in one episode. So, thank you guys so much for watching, I really hope you enjoyed this. If you did, please leave a like. And if you want to see more content just like this, then please hit the subscribe button to stay up to date with all my videos and more. Thank you again, and I'll see you all next time. Bye bye!